And the deal is done. Welcome back to Full Circle with Mikali. How are you doing? So, hmm, this segment is about to be lit. Yeah? They are beautiful humans. It's husband and wife. And they look like they have a beautiful story. And you know what? Because love is a gamble. We play that song for you. You get in, you don't know if it's going to work out. But then you pray and hope that this is it. It doesn't mean that it's smooth. We will have our issues, but do we choose each other every day? Relationship circle. We have an amazing, amazing couple in studio full of character, I tell you. First of all, Louisa, welcome to the show. Thank Her you. Royal Highness, you look Thank so you. good. I, I, I try now. I, I, I don't, I don't try. think you try. You know you're it. <laughs> thank you. Charles, welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank you so much. See your wife. She looks gorgeous. Very gorgeous. <laughs> I tried. I tried. I'm, I'm the one trying. <laughs> <laughs> you know, she was complaining that you're very far. Yeah. But we'll, yeah. we'll, we'll, it's okay for just a few minutes. Yeah. For just a few minutes. You all have different titles. You have different things that you do individually. And maybe we'll start with you, Louisa. Okay, well, today I came as an artist mm -hmm. because I just left the studio. We had a meeting in the morning. Uh -huh. And then um, also a lawyer by profession. That's what I've been doing for the last, I don't know how many years. Yeah. And I just wanted to like venture into my passions. I've also been acting on KTN. Oh. There's a program called My Two Wives. Before mm -hmm. that, there was Moshimiwa. Mm. Before that, I've also been involved in short movies. So acting and music have always been on the background because mm -hmm. I wanted to get my, my law done with. And uh, number one, I'm a mom uh for uh, for um six kids six mm -hmm. boys mm -hmm. so i'm very blessed to be here on this show i'm such a fan of you oh, and you. yeah I'm, I'm glad to be here thanks for having me oh what's my business oh biashara oh, god you know me i don't think about that as a profession but yeah I'm, <laughs> but I'm, it's a, I'm, you do it i'm an entrepreneur yes um i i do sell human extensions this is some mm -hmm. of our collection this our really semi-human collection yeah um, I also do jewelry. I also do perfume. E like the title says, look good, feel good. Okay. So whatever makes you look good will make you feel good. That's true. So everything is under that bracket. Okay. Yeah. Great. Charles, yeah. you also have a couple of titles under the belt. So please. Yeah. My name's uh, Evangelist Charles. Mm. Ugo mm -hmm. uh, Actually, I'm a businessman. I am to real estate, back home, and eventually here. Then I'm also a producer. Ah. Yes, uh, we have a uh, production company, music and movie production company called East West Records. Okay. But generally East West Productions. Okay. In Nigeria and in Kenya here, we're into movie and music production. Mm. And also, yeah, yeah, we are trying to help to raise up some some artists here in Kenya. That's really yeah, nice. In East Africa and in Kenya especially. I see the thing. Artist, actor, producer. Is that how you guys met? How did you guys meet? No. 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 Oh goodness! How did you guys meet? Should I or should you? Hi. <laughs> you are in better position to explain it. Uh, <laughs> then I can correct you if there's, <laughs> if there's an error there. <laughs> okay, I was Lisa. just in campus, 2012. Okay. There was this new joint. Guys were telling me mm -hmm. it was called Tribeca. Yes. They just opened. Mm -hmm. and they had Dragon Night, I think, on Thursdays. Mm -hmm. A day to, like today. Yes. <laughs> so me, I'm in my house minding my business. My friend calls me. Hey, where are you? Shout out to Jessica. So she goes <laughs> like, let me take you out. We go, because you know, I'm always the, like, I always make everybody laugh. So when mm -hmm. they go out without me, it's boring. Uh -huh. So they drag old me, nini, nini. So I just bump into uh, Mr. Ugo here. Uh -huh. And you know that time, you're, you're so skeptical with everything you're told about uh, West Africans. Ooh, and, you know, yes. you're like, now this one. <laughs> 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 and Nini uh, I, I played hard to get for a while. So but you met at that particular I, night. I, he, he, he called me. I said hi to so him. So you you met and exchanged numbers. I wrote it on a piece of, of paper. I wrote it on a, on, a, on a toilet paper. I think it was a napkin or serviette. Yes. Because I wasn't really sure, you know. But then he was like, I'll call you. Then he was like telling me he's an evangelist. And I was like, evangelist? To call Tribeca. <laughs> <laughs> so boom, boom, twaf. He was like, I've seen something in you. And I think maybe, let, let, let me see how I can, I can correct. I think you're a good person. Let me see. So yeah, that's how we met. Mm. And, and that's how my life changed. Nikanza kwa chakonda kwa club. I angoja kidogo na pele kambali, Louisa. So, yeah. you tell her you'll call her. Mm. Actually, and then she's playing hard to get. Actually, yeah. she was kind of a busybody. We call it busybody. You know that time? She was here. She, yeah, she was here. I said, hey, come here. 
Why are you all up and down? Can't you stay one place? <laughs> so I just I just met her as somebody who's I look at her heart. Okay. You know when you see somebody mm. by the behaviors and uh, attitude, you know that this person has a good heart. Mm. I don't mm -hmm. want to look at her other so I said, Come here. She came. You know, I told her to give me her number. She said, um, um I said, okay. <laughs> <laughs> then I was surprised when they have gone, when they had gone, so my friend, not a, a friend actually, uh, the, a waitress came to me and uh, gave me a, a written number. Mm -hmm. I said, wow, I thought she has gone. I think she saw something as well. Yes, maybe she saw mm -hmm. something else, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. So from that day, we started, uh, but uh, she played hard to get, actually. <laughs> yeah, she played hard, actually, she, to get there. Uh -huh. Because I tried a lot of tricks. <laughs> Not working. Not working, she was just, you know, when I when I discovered that, uh, you, know, you know, friends yes. trying to, you know, change her view about yes. me, yes. probably maybe because I'm a Nigerian mm -hmm. or West African. Mm -hmm. I said, okay, let me leave you with your friends. So I carry her along with her friends. Ah. That was how I won her. Ah, <laughs> yes. Yes, my sister. All her <laughs> friends in the, uh, all her friends at you, uh, We used to pack. We used. To, you know those days there was no Uber, so you can't mm. order for the big Uber. No. So there was one guy called Karoro. Hi uh -huh. Karoro. <laughs> like he would come with a small old car. You know that uh, a manual one that you yes. had to push. Yes. So all five girls we have to pack inside there. Mm -hmm. Until we are going out. Then once we go there, I have to lie that I don't know who has died. We have to go. We're just going to go to another place. But you know, those small a lies. Of, a lot of dramas. Those small lies when you're in campus so that you you, you, you know, you just want to help her. Yes. So that's See, that there's, there's fun somewhere else. Yeah. Some of our friends are elsewhere. Yeah. So you ditch him a couple of times. Then you forget you had said that she was that other auntie who died. So now, when the same auntie is dying and resurrecting and dying. You were very patient, Charles. <laughs> I tried. Very patient. I tried. How long until you officially started dating? It was a while. 2012, actually. We started 2012, mm -hmm. up to date. But I, I changed a lot of perspectives about uh, <laughs> Nigerians and West Africans. Yeah. When she okay. Kept, when she what was the, what was the, the what was the loudest thing about West African men that kept you at bay? You know, um, I'd rather well, just. Well, I had met some of them okay. as friends mm -hmm. and just like just never really liked how they were operating and stuff. Okay. And I really wanted a, a friendship. So that I could study him. Okay. And that's the first thing that we did. You we became, became friends. Because even him, as much as me, I was looking at him like this. He was also looking at me. Okay. Who is this girl? Mm -hmm. She says she's in, 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 she's doing law. Where, you know, like he'd even drop me in school. So we're all, we're all investigating each other at this particular point. <laughs> CIDs. <laughs> Trying to figure out who this other person was. Mm -hmm. And I think for a long time that really helped, I think, also to bring us to where we are. Yes. Because at the end of the day, when mm -hmm. after all this time, mm -hmm. that sometimes, maybe sometimes, like you're angry with each other. Yes. But then that, that whole thing of just staying together and just chilling. Yeah. We're not discussing about anything. Or We're anyone, just chilling. Because he would call mm -hmm. me. Mm -hmm. What are you doing on Saturday or Friday? Because I remember every Friday I was with him. So I was trying to, I was trying to see, hmm? not even at he, Nigeria, even with the Kenyan guys. Mm -hmm. You know, Kenyan guys, they always have a girlfriend for, okay, I'm not saying all, gosh, please. I'm not saying all. Okay, let's just say men. I don't want to be in trouble. <laughs> There's some men who have like a girlfriend for like Monday, yes, Tuesday. Especially the weekends. And, yes, especially the weekends. Yes. So I was trying to see where I fit in. Ah. But it's like, oh, he calls me on Monday. What are you doing? We can have maybe some coffee. Maybe yes. we can meet on Wednesday at K1. He'd always like pick me from school. Oh, and on Friday, he'd take me. We just like, he'll come. Make for me a goosey. That was my first time eating a goosey. I loved it. <laughs> Make for me pepper soup. Like he would literally, I didn't know how to cook at this point. <laughs> so like he would literally just do that. And so I, I was just trying to see, okay, yeah. this guy doesn't, ha doesn't have many chicks. Yes. You know? He doesn't have many excuses. Yeah. Yeah. Because also, Leo, no, back then, you know, not, that's what mm, West African guys were mm, known for. Yes. Especially those ones who've just made money like yes. this. They had like a hundred. Mm. So the fact that... um. He he was consistent with me mm -hmm. and always was honest with me. Mm -hmm. I felt that that was something. Okay, yeah. okay. And um, when did we get married? Oh, I th Charles, you're very quiet. You know, I, we ask us uh, and continue know, for a while. You know, my wife, she she's a, she talks a lot. <laughs> so I allow her to finish, then I come in. <laughs> <laughs> you know. So actually, mm -hmm. we started on a good note. Mm -hmm. I was about. 
I was about a kind of uh, trying to change so many things, not even changing because... It's what not is the one thing that you really wanted her to sort of like stop or take her at a different route? You know, then uh, there were a group of girls at the <laughs> University of Nairobi. You the know, five that were you in know the that car. Th Those days they like to hang out. Yes. They drink on the high hills, mm -hmm. you know, staggering on the street after the show, after the, <laughs> you know, so what I do, I need to try to pull her pull out, her out. But from you know, the crowd. When you are trying to pull, uh, to um, remove something who, who, that, that is flexible yes. out of a stronger place, yeah. you need to be very, very gentle, gently and careful. Mm. So I, what I did was I have to use my initiative. If you try to separate th this girl now, it would be a kind of uh, a crash. Uh -huh. So what I did was I allowed them to go together. If I want to go, I will, uh, go out with her, I carried them along. <laughs> <laughs> I know it cost me a lot. A lot. <laughs> a lot. <laughs> a lot. A very lot. I, I tell you. Sometimes she comes. She want to go. They want to go to another place where is uh, maybe I, 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 that that wasn't the place I want to be at yes. that particular time. It's okay. How many are you? How many of how many of, of, of friends you have? He said, look, I give her money. A lot then of go. money. Go and take care of your friends. Oh my goodness. You know, with that, I was able to allow her now to choose. Yes. The, the better part. Because you're not forcing her. Yeah, no, and I'm you're not, not pulling her yes, out. Yes, but yes. you're showing her, I will love you even yeah. if this is what you choose. Yes, yes. And then you wait for her to choose you. Yes. Mm -hmm. We're taking a very short commercial break. Charles and Louisa are still here. <laughs> Send in your questions, triple one, triple four, triple one. We will be right back after this break. <laughs> Welcome back to Full Circle. Louisa and Charles still in the building and we are talking about their love life. Yes, I hope you've been following and taking notes. You can be living your own life, but your Mr. Man will find you there and will let you choose. So he didn't force anything. So at what point did you decide, this is it, we're going to be together and I choose you? Because he's letting you make the decision. Yeah. He's not pulling you out from this lifestyle that you have. Yeah. At what point did you say, you know what, now I see. Apart from everything else I've been told about West African men, this one is different and this one is for me. The point when one day he asked me, like, have you given your life to Christ? And I was like, nobody asks you that. Like, no. no. No, I mean, <laughs> people do, but me, I, I, was, I didn't see it coming. Yeah. You know, I was expecting Plus you're in the middle of like, partying. Yeah. So he, he goes like, have you given? I was like, uh, yeah, I used to sing in choir in high school. Yeah, I, I was the but then I was the best in Quiet Alliance. Shout yeah. out to Alliance girls. Yes. So uh, he asked me that question and that um, that stayed home, you know. And then he would keep on sending me these Bible verses, which he does until today. And he sends even to my whole family, my mom, my dad, everybody. Uh -huh. So he would send those Bible verses, and it started. I started, and that time I was staying up Karibu na Kipande Road, mm -hmm. you know, Ngara. Yes. Just near school. Mm -hmm. So then I started. Uh, watching uh kathy kuna on the on the tv mm -hmm. and then i went to the church and then i gave my life to christ again just just so that you know so that at least we can be on the same standing okay. because here i am oh we are happy we are happy the next morning he's so he's dressed he's sober he's clean he's going to church me i'm like okay me, I'm I'm over over somebody hey, you know i'm like okay <laughs> what's what's this sometimes you can even wake up at four start praying and praying and praying and praying and I'm like, I've never seen this kind of dedication for a man yes. to God. Yes. You know, to a point he'll even, even kneel down and hold my hand and like, babe, let's pray. And I was like, wow. So that, that was the point. Oh my goodness. That was the point. And now the, the next bit was, now we weren't to officiate this thing. And I have to tell my parents and you have to introduce him as well. Uh, of course, by this time, they've already noticed that there's a consistent man in your life. Mm -hmm. So how was that for you? Uh, going back home and be like, you know what? I found the one. Actually, um, like she said, I saw that most youths in the uh, in Kenya. Let me use Kenya as an example. Most youths, the the religion and the Christianity has eluded mm. them, the system, you know. So, and I found out that most of them needed somebody to help them come back to Christ. Mm -hmm. Despite, you have to show them that despite their partying, 
drinking, enjoying, it doesn't make them a sinner. It doesn't. It doesn't to re re reduce their pr p them in the presence of God. Mm. So that is actually what they needed. You don't have oh. to tell them because you are, not, uh, you are drinking, because you are clubbing, mm -mm. you are doing this, Christ hates you, no. God don't love you. So I tried to bring her to that level. Now, uh, coming to the when we started, uh, when we planned to stay together, um, I actually noticed in her that she wanted to settle down. Oh. Yes, after because I was monitoring her till she finished her university. I was with her she, she finished her university. She went to Kessel. She finished. Then she got pregnant. Mm -hmm. At that point, I told her, now this is the the beginning of this our. This is it. Yeah. This is the beginning of our. We can't continue for how many years. Hey, uh, let's hey. just go. Then I call her. I said, I call Mze. I said, please, sir, <laughs> let me come and they put a, a drink, like a kind of an engagement yes. on her head. Yes. That's what all. And you know, it's one thing dating. Mze comes to me. Mze, Yeah. Okay. My dad is those people like. Uh, I don't know if you know about Ekwe, Ekwe Thuro, mm -hmm. the former Senate Speaker. Yes. So, you know, you oh. don't approach that kind of person. At the okay. end, hey, hi, what's up? No. How are you doing? Bro? No, 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 no. So, we had a dinner, first of all, just to, uh, an informal dinner where my husband came and I was there. And uh, my husband was like, uh, okay, now uh, I, 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 I'm planning of doing this introduction, what we call ratio. Yes. And I hope that uh, that everything is okay. And my dad was like, okay. You know, he doesn't say a lot of a lot of things, but he was like, okay. Now, all of a sudden, the spot was on him. So where in Nigeria do you come from? Oof. Where, like, he was he was like under inquisition, you know, like what someone who's been do? put on the watch. Scru yeah. Scrutiny. 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 <laughs> what do you do for a living? What, what, what company? Let me check it up. You know, everything. Oh and he has resources. Yes, yeah, he yes. can check up yes. anything. Yes. Anything, yes. 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 But at the end of the day, <laughs> do diligence. The, at the end of the day, <laughs> all, all, all my mother wanted to know was like, do you love him? Oh. And I was like, yeah. I'm like, if you love him, it's okay. Even if he's, he's, he's a bicycle owner, it's fine. <laughs> like, at the end of the day, my father was like, are you happy? Yes. Will you manage? Yes. Will you, don't go there, then come back home and say, ah, I'm tired. No. No. Even now, that's not an option. No. If you're tired, you go back and work it out again. <laughs> so also like, I'm happy that my parents were not so like, okay, you have to marry like a, tea, a doctor or a lawyer. No, or no, 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 no. Are you happy? Are you happy? Is he God-fearing? Yes. Is he a family man? And that's oh. the first thing that I liked about him. He's yes. so into family. Okay. Even when it's not his. Like sometimes yes. I'd be fighting with my siblings. He will come and he'll be like, no, don't, don't, don't do that to your, your sister. Apana, we have to sort this out. You get? Yeah. So that's, it was difficult at the beginning mm -hmm. but later when we did the whole introduction he came with the whole of CV Nigerian embassy <laughs> my husband was, I mean <laughs> my husband was like he was like the center of Loretto at that particular time yes yeah so I think my, my father saw his heart and even yes. until now they're good buddies okay so yeah, yeah. The, the, the family actually they were in support of our relationship because it, it took us a long time yes because my family back home and here both of them, they know each other and uh, they supported me. Okay. Even the dad, the dad they actually just like a, a kind of a child father relationship. Yeah. He doesn't want to know what. Uh, uh -uh. Says, Sanchez, where, where, where are you? Let us go and uh, sit down and drink <laughs> and talk. Yeah, let's talk. Uh, let's talk. I'm, I'm, you know, yes. he takes me like his a, a son, you know? That's, I think so it's I'm a very, I'm very, very uh, much, I'm very happy the way they welcome me, despite the stories about Nigeria. You know, mm. Nigerians, let me tell you a bit about Nigerians. People <laughs> are listening, hearing a lot of things about Nigerians. Please Niger tell us. There are always good men yeah. everywhere. Mm. Nigeria has a lot of nice, good hearted family men. Let me say family men. Yes. Family men. Okay. You know, and uh, in relationship, it needs a lot of understanding. Mm. So you have to learn. Mm -hmm. Not learning to to end that you have concluded and you close the book. Mm -mm. You have to learn till both of you are exhausted. Okay, mm. it's continuous practice about relationship. We are, we are, we have we have encountered a lot of difficulties Which in the relationship. Yes, we have been together, living together as a couple for the past three years now. Mm. Two thousand and eighteen. Mm -hmm. Yes, I think we did uh, our introduction two thousand eighteen. Mm -hmm. So since then we've been together. You know, there are always ups and downs in a relationship. Yeah. But the most important thing is that 
when you look at your person, make sure that your your spouse is your friend. That's yeah. true. That's number one. Yeah. Because first of all, when I met her, I took her as a friend. Yes. If you like somebody before loving somebody, it will take you a long way. Mm -hmm. If you like somebody, then you, you develop the love. That's true. Lo I believe in love at first sight, but it, it, sometimes it crashes. Let's just, let's mm -hmm. love it first sight, but be friends first mm -hmm. yes. before anything yes, else. Yes, yes. You know? <laughs> and, and it's a beautiful thing. And now 2018, it's official. Yeah. We are one. We have a child on the way. And now we have to be in the same space. What is the one thing that you were just like, oh my God, yes, I know I love you and I will be here for you, but see what you watch your socks go flow. <laughs> no, I don't think I had that thing with him. Mm -hmm. Probably um, um, because of, I'm bipolar. Uh, I'm bipolar too. Okay. So uh, I think the thing with me was with my, with my bipolarness, my yeah. mood swings. Yes. So it, he doesn't have to do anything to annoy me. He'll already find me annoyed. You, you understand? <laughs> yeah. So he'll just, uh, will, I'll just look for something, just for something to, to argue about, you know? Mm -hmm. And then he's actually very clean. He doesn't leave any. Like, there's nothing wrong about this man. I'm, I'm, I'm not. Maybe the to, question, no, Lisa, to you. You should ask you, him how he manages Charles me. Hi. <laughs> how are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> how was that for you, you know, handling? And she's admitted that uh, she's quite moody and it's a condition that she has to live with. And you have to as well. How do you handle that when you don't even understand why she's angry or she's moody? Yeah. Um Actually, I learned about her being bipolar mm -hmm. uh, some years after we have met. Okay. So, but it takes a lot of, let me tell you, it's a, it's a, 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 a mental health uh, um, uh, issue. Yes. Which she needed somebody, any, let me say, patient, but any bipolar patient needed a matured mind. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. You don't need somebody who, who will always compare his, ne his mood with yours. Ah, yes. so when I find you so, angry, I'm also angry. Yes, That yes, should not yes. be the case. There you are putting the f a, 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 a fire on fuel. Mm. What you need to do, what I, how I balance them is most of the time I see her being moody, mm -hmm. I just try to condition my mind okay. to allow her to calm down. Because you can see that the person that is moody, Natural is a, is a nice person. Yeah. She does everything good. So yeah. you can't just say because this person has an, uh, that kind of uh, something that you can manage, you yeah. just throw away with a child <laughs> with the bucket. I can say, I can't stop smiling. <laughs> throw, 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 <laughs> throw the water away with the child. No. You know, you don't do that. So yes. I try to be matured. It's very, very important. Yeah. And um, I want to use this opportunity to talk to men, please, fellow men. Please. When you find out that Charles, this is your camera. Please yes, talk to them. When you find out that you're you have a spouse who has a kind of, who is, you know, battling with a kind of health issue, um, uh, mental health awareness, all this and that. You need to support the person because we, we can we, we are not the same. No, we are not. In relationship, we need to put all. They said, they, w w they said, um, for uh, for better, for worse. Mm. So if you can be able to say, okay, I love you, I want you to be my wife, you need to take up, take up the challenges. You need to take up the challenges. Yeah. So I I'm just trying to talk to our fellow men to be patient with them, okay. with our women. And also, our women, our women, Kenya, Please. Women, <laughs> Kenya women, Nigerian yes. women, African yes. women, yes. you must be so much sober and be respectful mm. to a man you call your husband. husband yeah. A boss lady, a boss lady can be a boss lady at shop, at office, mm -hmm. at workplace. Mm -hmm. Don't bring boss lady yes. to the house, yes. to the husband. Because the husband always the head of the family. That's true. We can always change things. We can elect a woman as a president, governor, MPs, any position all over the world. But when that woman gets home, she drops her position at the doorstep mm. to be able to attend to the family and know that the man is the head of the family. Respect is number one. Men, yes. men, love. Men lost because of the ego of men. Mm. If you, you can eat a, a man's money, I'm telling you, man, you can eat his money, <laughs> but if you disrespect him, he will not be happy with you. Yeah. You can do a man anything because of we have ego. Mm. That ego, we didn't, we didn't create it by ourselves. No. It's just from God. Yeah. So we can't change it. Mm. In as much as there's a gender, we're preaching about gender equality yes, and that. Yes. Men remain men and women remain women. And they are like mother to us. I urge women to see their husbands like their child. Aww. You don't correct them with... with 
anger. No, we have love. to. Yeah, whenever they are messed up, we know we can mess up as men. Yes. Just open your hands and welcome us back. Then we can be able to correct it. That's my. It's the same thing because even women, we mess up. It's not yes, just yes, men. Yes. It's, it's all about up. men and women. Yes. Also, in addition, thanks for bringing that up, babe. Um, this okay. W one of the biggest difficulties. I can't say it's because of him. It's mm -hmm. also because of cultural differences, yes. living together. Yes. It was so much easier when we were living apart and courting. Mm -hmm. But now when you bring the Nigerian culture and then you bring the Kenyan culture, and yes. I'm a Trukana woman for that matter. Where, where? Trukana women don't even know. The, I don't even think there's a word called submission in the Trukana vocabulary. Okay? In, if, if you Google it up, traditionally, Trukana women, before you get married to your husband, everybody's given a cane. You must beat each other. Huh? Yes, before ah, you, the man marries you. Lisa. I'm telling you the truth. Mm -hmm. Muna chapana. Muna chapana ile proper. Why? Yes. Actually, actually so that as look, a at woman, her, look at her. Hey. Fle very flexible. How can you touch this one? You can't. You can't so touch this as one. As a woman, <laughs> you, 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 you maintain, you know, whoever wins the fight is always going to be in control of that. So I, I found myself just fighting so that I could get some control. Oh like my we'll fight goodness. over the most smallest thing. Where to hang maybe a painting, where to do this. And sometimes I sit back and I'm like, oh my God. Oh my God. What's wrong with me? I need to just let him be, you know? Yeah. Because also, sometimes women will say, oh, this man has a temper. But no, if you re if you rewind before the temper, <laughs> <laughs> if you rewind, you'll remember what you did. Yes. Mm? What you did to, so to you make that So you struggled with that a lot. I'm still struggling. Okay, I'm okay. Still struggling. Work in progress. It's work in progress. Yes. But every time, sometimes I'll sit in my room because we actually have separate bedrooms. Oh. And it helps. Because when, yes. he's, when he's pissed off, let me tell you, even the cockroaches in the house will not even walk. <gasps> so I let him cool off. He'll go watch Netflix or something. I go watch, uh, what's her name? Uh, Joyce Meyer. Because yes. she reminds me a lot of myself. She also <laughs> dealt with submission <laughs> for a long time. Uh -huh. And her mouth, she's also dealing with her mouth, Joyce Meyer. I'm also learning how to deal with my mouth. Because this mouth, you see this thing called a mouth? Yes. Wow, 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 wow. Sometimes it will get me into so much trouble with him. Okay. Because I'll say something when I'm angry and I don't really mean it. But... For him, how he'll take it, it'll be like, this is disrespect of the highest order. Oh, my goodness. I don't expect this from my wife. So I'll go to my room, then maybe I'll just come to his room now quietly, like, I'm just minding my business, or I'll, I'll bring food. Uh -huh. You know, there's a way you come quietly. Yeah, there's a way even there's he will come. read even submission now, and that like, like, okay, okay. I think, she, I see I think now she knows, I yeah, think now she, she knows. knows where she went wrong. Mm, and mm. then, you know, and then maybe we'll talk about it now when he's come, and then now we'll, we'll sort it out. Okay. But the goodness with us, we never let it boil over. Yeah, that is ah. actually uh, what that is actually what makes us to balance the situation because sometimes you don't have to allow. Maybe you have an anger issue or you have a, a, a kind of disagreement with your spouse. Mm -hmm. You go and sleep tomorrow. You come out with a strong face again. You mm -hmm. know, mm -hmm. that's what I've, that's actually one of the best nature of her. Okay, you f f fight with her, quarrel with her. The next the next one hour. She's just, I'm asking myself, was it not this person I just <laughs> quarrel with? <Yeah. laughs> you know? So, but now, um, what makes it last longer, I think, is staying together. Okay. Number one, s sleeping together, mm -hmm. praying together. That she has her room, bedroom, doesn't necessarily mean that she's sleeping there. Oh, it's her okay. bed, her clothes, everything decorated, but she sleeps in my room. Okay. Yes, it's, that's how we do in West Africa. You ha you, oh, oh, that yes, is, that's oh, how, yes. So you also had to learn that. Yes, women has their room. And I like it. Okay. Because at okay. least I get to have a purple bed, I get to oh, put pink walls, I okay. get to put yes. all those nice things. And that space is good. Yeah. When you have an issue, yes. she goes to her room, you yes. go to your room, yes. you give yourself a, a little space. Okay. With that little space, you can be able to analyze what, what caused the, what was the yeah. problem, how you have offended the person, the partner yes and what happened how she has offended you before you come back together not allowing it to take longer yeah you have you find out that this is resolved i think i'm learning i love it i love it i love it i love it and the fact that you are intentional in everything that you do mm -hmm. that you will wake up in the morning and be like you know i did not do him well yesterday I did not, yeah. so i will take time today and be intentional about saying i'm sorry mm. that i will not do that again mm. that you do not deserve that mm -hmm. that you're still my husband and i still love you mm -hmm. oh i love it even <laughs> if it's not verbal because yes. some of us saying sorry is a problem ah, but, <laughs> but he knows i think sorry. i'm team charles now <laughs> <laughs> he knows i'm sorry no but the
the goodness with him, I always make sure even if even if even if whatever it is, we must sort it. Yeah. Yeah. We must sort that's, it and that, we must finish major, it. That's okay. Because that's okay. why people are killing each other nowadays. That is so true. Because people are holding so many mm. things. So many mm. grudges, yeah. You, it, it boils over. It, then it explodes all at once. That's okay. how you find all this murdering. And let's just talk it out. No matter how bad it is. Let's talk it let's, out. Yes, and let's say the truth. Okay. No matter how bad it is. Sincere to each other. Yeah. That sincerity is very, very important. I love it. I love the way that you guys are just open. And it's important because people are learning as well. Let's talk about the business bit of you before we let you go. You guys work together you have businesses together how <laughs> what is just with your eyebrows how is that how is that working together hustling together mimi nam tuangu i go first yes please well um i guess it's it's a bit of a hassle yeah you know um i'm actually looking for a job here so that i can i can leave uh, him alone enjoy <laughs> camera phone <laughs> camera number 5 <laughs> tv please please uh, if, if you need um uh, someone with good oral skills eh? yes this is me uh, anyway uh on a serious note it's hard to work with your spouse. It's not that it's difficult or it's impossible, yes. but it's hard. There are days I might over overstep. Maybe I might say this and maybe he wanted to say this, you ah, know? Yes. Or maybe I might go tell the producers this and maybe he had told them something different. Okay. You get? Yes. You know in the house when you're dealing with a nanny, it's you to say. Yes. You don't tell the nanny this, this, but when both of you I'm the managing director and he's the CEO. Okay. So sometimes I'll come up in the moment and I'll be like, hey, you guys, why don't you do this on this song and do this? And he didn't give his okay. So that would bring a lot of issues. And now I've learned, before I, I go to the group and text, do this and this, I'm like, babe, I, I have this idea. What do you think about this song? Or what do you think about these vocals? Or what do you think about this beat? Do you think we should do this? And he goes like, oh, okay. We'll go talk about it in the meeting. So that I don't okay. go ahead and overstep. Okay. So even there, I also have to know like, my yes, limits. yes, yes, we are we are partners, but uh, we are also one front. We are also one front. I can't come like I'm here and he's here. No. Yeah. Charles, your sentiments on this before we go on a break. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we, we have been trying to manage uh, each other and affairs of business. Yes. Uh, uh, this start before we established the East West Records. Uh -huh. We have been doing things together. Okay. But you know, partnership and familyhood. It's, it's, it's just about a kind of, mm. you need to, I told her sometimes, I said, you need a manager. <laughs> because number one, she's the managing director of the company mm -hmm. and she's a, our artist. She's an artist. <laughs> so I told her, in the artist, in your singing. Please let me talk to the manager, just, not just you. Just please. Yes. Because I can't, it's, it's very hard for me <laughs> and you to go about it. You, t let me talk to your manager. Yes. But in the other aspect of managing the resources, uh, managing our artists, our mm. producers, and mm. our music and all that things, yes. even her own um, 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 art, um, acting, acting yes. pro, uh, uh, decision, I always advise her. Okay. You know, it's very important to have a spouse, uh, maybe a wife, who is submissive, who has given you hand to work on her. Oh, so true. she actually has given me that hand oh. to work on her. So see, it's not all bad. It was hard. It's hard. But it's 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 working. There's it's a working, balance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But to me, we submit. Yes. We say my pale. Switch TV. Yes. Yes. I even yeah. talked to my bosses at Insignia, and I told them, you guys, now we have to be doing uh, day scenes. We have to be doing nice, uh, no kissing scenes. And no. <laughs> 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 Thank you guys for coming. Our time is really up. <laughs> <laughs> no more kissing scenes no for Louisa. Louisa. Charles says no, 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 yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah. no, no, no. I'm somebody's um, <laughs> husband and she's my wife. Thank you guys. God bless you and keep doing what thank you're doing you. and thank, thank you for sharing you so your story with us. us. Thank you. We're taking a very short commercial break. We will be right back. <laughs>